head, we will happily take some lower humidity, especially this mm -hmm. morning. It was just a beautiful, crisp morning and it turned into a pretty nice afternoon as well. Our high temperature today right at 90 degrees. Check out that morning low though. We got down to 68 degrees and that is the first time we've had a low temperature in the 60s since June 29th, so a couple months ago. And of course, we've still got a little bit of summer to go, but I think that's a sign we are starting to get a little closer to fall. And you can actually see that here. I looked back at the average high temperature each month, and you see we peak between about July and August. This red line is today, so you see we are just coming over the hill. And from here on out, it looks like those temperatures are going to be going down as we get a little closer to fall and winter. Now tonight, a big night in the Memphis area. Of course, the golf championship winding down. We've still got the Redbirds game going on and a lot of partying going on. I'm sure the weather looks good for that down into the 80s through about 8 p.m. 79 by 9 o'clock, but a mostly clear sky and no chance of rain. That trend continues tonight. I expect it's going to be a really nice night, kind of similar to last night. Just a couple of clouds out there. 69 year low temperature in Memphis, mid 60s in western Tennessee, northern Mississippi and eastern Arkansas. So if you're going to be out late tonight, leave the rain gear at home. You're not going to need it. Now tomorrow we do get a little bit warmer up to 94 degrees by the afternoon. That humidity also just a little bit higher, but other than that, still a really nice day out there for the last day of the golf championship. West southwesterly winds around six miles an hour and just the slightest chance of rain as we go into the evening. I don't think the daytime is going to have any weather concerns. In fact, that rain chance 0% at least into the afternoon, 93 degrees again by about 3 p.m. But after sunset tomorrow, maybe a sprinkle somewhere. I'm just not too sold on it. That's why it's only at a 10% chance. Slightly better chance for a couple of pop up storms by Monday, but really it's going to be Tuesday night into Wednesday that we look for our next best chance of rain and storms and then rain chances go back down for the end of the week and the weekend. Could be some heavy rain though, especially by Wednesday morning. Looks like a half an inch to an inch of rain possible in some locations. But again, no rain expected tomorrow. Sunny and warm, 94 degrees. Slight chance of a couple of storms by Monday, but it really looks like Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. We're going to start to see that rain roll in. Look what the rain does to our temperatures. Wednesday, 80 degrees is the high temperature, but we are warmer and sunnier by the end of the week and the weekend.